Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Jacob Sharman, and today I wanted to go over my recent experience with the new social media app, Clubhouse. Clubhouse is a new app that came out about two months ago that has taken the world by storm. Real estate agents are seeing such great results on this app, and in my 48 hours of using this app, I have seen amazing results that I wanted to go over with today. That's why this app is a must for new real estate agents. Let's get started. So a little over 48 hours ago, I was actually invited to use the Clubhouse app. I have received several invitations before, but I just wasn't feeling it because one, it's in beta testing. You have to have an Apple product to be able to download the app. And two, I just didn't want to learn a whole new social media app. But let me tell you what, I am so glad I got on this app. And in 48 hours, I've seen so much success that I can't wait to keep using this app. It is a great way to get some referrals and network with people. It's a great way to grow your brand and your following organically. And it's a great way to learn from some of the best people in the industry. So what is Clubhouse? Clubhouse is an audio based app. And if you've ever been to an expo or convention, you always have these breakout rooms. And that's exactly what it is. Somebody has created a club or a room and people go into it and they can listen and talk. And we'll get into some more details about the app so you can kind of understand what it looks like and how to use it. So I'm gonna pull out my iPhone and I'm gonna kind of give you a quick tutorial so you can kind of see what I'm talking about and um, you can learn how to use the app. So right here, you're gonna see that the clubhouse has this dude on it and that's the app. So we're just gonna click it to open it and now you see my screen. So let's go ahead and click my profile picture and this is my profile that everybody sees. I've seen a lot of people on this app, just in the short time I've been on it, they haven't really leveraged this bio. While you're sitting in rooms listening to people, you can click on them, um, read their bio, see who they are, how many people are following them. You can also see their social media and you wanna know who's in there. So go ahead and leverage your bio, put who you are, who you are at the core, what services you offer, what you bring to the table, any accomplishments you have. Even as a new agent, leverage some of your, if you're hardworking and you're organized, those type of things, put it in there. Let people know who you are and why they should follow you. So as you can see in mine, we talk about who I am, what I am a real estate agent, I would do YouTube, um, tell people to subscribe to my channel if they want a consultation with digital marketing, uh, put all that stuff there, okay? Um, and then at the bottom, you'll see who referred them, who invited them to uh, TikTok. So my girl, Thermala, she invited me uh, to, to moderate one of her groups, which I'll talk about in a little bit. And that's how I got access to Clubhouse. Now, one thing that I wanna go over that I've noticed a lot of people making errors on. If you look right here, you see my Twitter and my Instagram. Um, make sure that you put and you actually connect. Don't just put your at symbol, uh, for Instagram, go ahead and connect your Instagram because it allows you to use the app inside the Clubhouse app while you're listening to people so you don't have to exit out. And two, you can't message people in Clubhouse. It's literally, you're sitting in the same room as everybody else and that's it. If you want to connect with that person or maybe you had some questions about what they what they said or you, you want had a referral for them, you have to go to their Instagram and DM them. So it's very important if you want people to contact you, you want people to follow you, make sure you're linking your Instagram inside there. Now, let's go ahead and go back and we're gonna go back to the home screen. So in the home screen, you can see right at the top, there's some upcoming classes, um, breakout rooms. Um, as you can see, here's the Zillow Killers, Mentor to Millions, Entrepreneurs, 21, 21 real estate. So these are all the groups that are currently going on that you can literally click in and join. So on the home screen, so let's start with the farthest left icon, which is the little envelope. Now if you click on that, it says you have one invite. So you get two invites when you sign up. As you create rooms, as you moderate rooms and stuff, they're gonna slowly give you another invite or, or so, okay? So if you look, I have one invite left. And so um, anybody that you invite, you're gonna do it through here and you're gonna see if they accepted your invitation or not. So let's go back. Now we're over to the calendar. Now the calendar is just gonna show you things that are upcoming and we're gonna show you why it shows you these specific things. So if you look, there's industry dive, 
corner office conversations, um, just all kinds of rooms. Now, if we go back and click the little bell notification icon, that's just gonna give us um, notifications. You can set up notifications when somebody is speaking. So maybe you've got a favorite speaker. You can actually set it to where it'll notify you every time you're, you're speaking in a room. Um, you can join a club, so every time that club has a meeting, it's gonna notify you as well. So this is just a list of upcoming things um, that, have, um, that are currently going on or that have expired. Now, if we click the little search button, that's gonna allow you to explore. So you can actually type in the name of a person you're looking for. So if you wanna find me on there, you're gonna type uh, Jacob Shireman. Or if you click over to clubs, then you're gonna be able to find some clubs that you're interested in, such as stuff that's in languages, place, sports, tech, things like that. Now let's go over to the settings because this is something that is important. So if we click on our profile and then we click the little settings button at the top, the gears, the thing that you're gonna wanna do is set up your interest. This is very important so you can see some of the activity that's going on. Um, for me, if you look, there's arts, faith, wellness, identity. Um, so I chose Spanish because I'm bilingual. Um, and then I come down, I was really interested in the hustle. That's basically my life as an entrepreneur. So I'm interested in networking, TikTok, Instagram, um, stocks, real estate, entrepreneurship, etc. Whatever you choose here, keep it specific. Don't just choose a bunch of random stuff because whatever you choose is going to be in your activity screen on your homepage. It's what it's going to notify you of. So if you start getting random things because of anime, it's because you checked it or you started liking rooms. So make sure your interests are specific to your goals of using this app. And that's how you're going to get the most out of it. Now, I would love to show you an example of how to use this amazing app and how the rooms work. But because nothing is recorded and you're not allowed to record, there's no example I can give you. Only just what the concept of how to use it. So if you want to interact on Clubhouse, you're going to click in one of those rooms that you saw. So in the feed, you click on it. Now, if you haven't been asked to moderate or be on a panel, you're going to enter as a listener. So you're able to listen to all these amazing people talk. Now, how to leverage this is you're going to want to get to the top of the screen. Um, if you're at the top of the screen, more likely people are going to click on you, start following you. That's what I do, especially the people that are talking. Um, it's a great way to interact. So in order to become a speaker, you, there's a little button to raise your hand. So you're going to click on to raise your hand. They're going to grant you access to what they call the stage. And then you can ask your question when they um, ask you to you know, introduce yourself or give your question. Now that's something that you're going to do, but only do this if you have a valuable question and remember people are listening to you and they want to follow you but if you give them a reason not to follow you you're just you know hurting yourself before you even get started okay so make sure you have a valuable question and then if you would like to speak or maybe add to what somebody else is talking about based on an experience make sure it's valuable as well what you want to do is get left on the stage during the whole time so people see you and you want to enter rooms and you want to get asked to come back and speak because of the value that you added to the group. So even as a new real estate agent, you can add value. So find your niche and, and get in there. You're in the new room and you want to know who moderators are. They're going to have a green icon next to them. And some of you are going to see party hats next to you and some other people. And that is just to signify new followers that have been on Clubhouse for less than seven days. How have I used this and how can you use this as a new agent? Um, like I said, I was invited to a group to moderate and to provide some value with my experience with digital marketing. Even though I'm a new real estate agent, in my first month I have experienced so much success and movement already because of my focus on marketing. In that group, I was a little hesitant to start because there's been people in that group of 20 plus years and people started talking and started asking questions. So I just, you know, started giving my input and, you know, my take on things and people started following me. By the end of that session, I had like 60 new followers and had people messaging me and even already scheduled on my calendar for a call about marketing, wanting to join my team here at EXP. Um, why, why they should choose me as their lineup. It was just crazy the amount of momentum I got within three hours. And I'm still getting that momentum, still having people contact me. So it is a great way as a new real estate agent 
to build your following organically. There's been so many live referrals right on that app and networking after the app that it's crazy because people are gonna see some value that you have to offer and they're gonna to wanna to learn for that. And it's one of the most positive environments that I have been in yet, especially on social media, is people looking to help each other. And it's not necessarily to to solicit yourself, but is to give back and to bounce ideas off each other. I have learned so much even though I've been in digital marketing. Now, there is a time sensitivity to this app for me because this app right now is limited to iPhone and iPad and Apple users, and you have to be invited by somebody. So once this app opens to the general public and to the rest of the world and Android users, it's gonna be so much harder to navigate um, just to find those people because then instead of rooms having a hundred, you're going to see thousands. And it's going to be so much harder to get your voice heard in those groups than right now. You know, get in there, start talking, start asking questions. Use it as a 24-7 tool. If you're up late at night, find a group that talks about marketing or overcoming objections or things that you struggle with and you can learn. It's a great thing to put on the car. Um, it's a great thing to replace with the TV for a little bit and actually learn. And you wanna make sure that you're giving value back as well. Don't just take, but give. Use this app to build your foundation and to get some organic traffic to get that jump start on your first year so you can crush it. Again, my name is Jacob Sharman. I'm here with my series on how to help real estate agents crush it in their first year. So if you have any comments, questions, put them down in the comments below. If there's some topics on videos that you wish to see, or you have questions about EXP, um, or maybe you need some help with marketing, go ahead and reach out to me. All my contact information is in the description, my cell phone number, my Calendly link, Follow me on all my social media. Make sure you uh, like and subscribe to this video for future videos that come out. Remember, I put out videos every week. And again, my name is Jacob Sharman, and I'll see you next week.